Thank you for Patreon now for donating to the Patreon. It's video, so back in another Pokemon Legend RCS video. So you guys I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't like, subscribe, and more stars, shall we? In the last one, we end up. Okay, fuck you. In the last, not you guys, the Zubat that just tried to attack me. In the last one, we end up making our way to the gr um, Grand Tree Arena to find out what's wrong with Clevior, the you know the noble Pokemon of that of the Pearl Clan. So we ended up going there. We end up finding Yder, who now likes us and wants us to ride on top of him. And I tried using the game to essentially get a freaking Chimchar because we all know Chimchar is my favorite Pokemon. So I tried. I failed. I have no idea where the fuck Chimchar is in this. I thought he was here because that's where he was last time, but he ain't here this time for some fucking reason. It's like we found an Alpha Stantler, which I thought was going to kill us considering, you know, Rapidash was a thing, but um, I managed to avoid it. Is that the Alpha? Well, if it was, I didn't care. Um, so, I guess we're, that's actually needed for revives, and I probably should have picked that up anyways, and I forgot Gyarados is fly in this game. Okay then, well, as they say, I don't care. So let's keep on moving forward, sadly we don't get to catch the Chimchar I so desperately wanted, but hey, it's fine. You live and you learn, I tried to pick up that item, it just didn't let me for whatever reason. Oh yeah, by the way, when you're on a ride Pokemon, you can't throw your Pokeballs or like anything, so... Remember that. You can pick stuff up, though. You just can't throw stuff, so... Pick that as you will. Uh, remember, you don't run into Pokemon, because they will end up... I'm sorry, is that a fucking Staraptor? Oh, that is a Staraptor! Holy shit, that's an actual Staraptor. Does it see us? Ah! Okay, how did I know that was coming? I instinctively... Okay, get the fuck away from me, bitches. Where, where, where's the map leading? Okay, that's where the map's leading. I, I instinctively moved out the way because I knew I was getting attacked. I just didn't know from what direction. Um, oh, there's a cricket tune. Well, we can use those, I guess. Um, you know, maybe we should try catching one because I haven't caught uh, you yet, actually. Let's throw that over there. Okay, I dead missed. No, stay. Come on, don't move. No, don't run away, coward. Okay, let's at least try to catch the Cricket Tune and see what happens. Hey! Okay, so the Cricket Tune wants to get caught, just not the other one. Oh! Um, Ace, Master to Move. I really hope that was Ember. It should be Ember. I'd be damned if it's not. I mean, I'm disappointed because, you know, we didn't get the team member we want last time. I mean, I still wanted a Zubat. I did make that clear. I wanted a Zubat, but I did want to catch that Chimchar, even if we weren't going to use it. Okay, you can get the fuck away from me. Ow! Dick! Ah! Okay, get the hell away. Um, but yeah, I guess we don't get to have nice things. But there is another team member we can actually catch. And I didn't get the chance to catch him last time. So, we can just make the leap. No, wait, wait no, 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 no. Stantler, no, Stantler, Stantler, not like this, not like this, not like this. Come on, go go downstream, go downstream, go downstream. There we go. Okay, can, can we not go faster? Oh, there we go. Um, I don't know how to encounter the site. Okay, wait. Because I want to encounter the Scyther, because I do... Because, for those of you that don't know, Clevior does straight up evolve from Scyther, and we'll see how it looks like that in a second, but for now... Oh, I threw out Ace, that's a good thing I missed. Oh! Fuck! Um, uh, plan B, plan B, plan B, plan B, run away. I didn't, I didn't do anything. Ah, story, go! I didn't do anything. What, what Pokeball? What are you talking about, Scyther? So you say that you galaxy people come up with methods to quell, try to quell Lord Clever's fury? Frenzy? Eh? Yeah. What? You'll mash up Clever's, Clever's favorite foods into balls so you can throw the offerings at him? Well, that's quite an orthodox approach. You galaxy people, your inventiveness just blows me away. I mean, now you can make offerings to Lord Clever from a safe distance. I'll lend you my aid if it, if it means we might provide for Clever with his offerings. Let's begin at once. Hold on, Leanne. Don't get ahead of yourself. Okay, Rude, what are you against? I thought you wanted us to help you. Whatever the plan is, you'll need to you need Clevior's favorite plump beans. I brought them, as promised. God, that's right, my apologies, Iridia. I've forgotten all about you. Wow, that's mean. Like she's your leader, dude, and you forgot about her? Damn. I admit, as we haven't been able to solve this ourselves, we may have we seem to have a little choice but to turn to the galaxy team. But even if I still have doubts about whether we should entrust such a thing to an outsider, these galaxy team people don't share our customs and our values. 
So prove to me you're worthy to stand in the presence of our noble Pokemon. You may battle by ordering the Pokemon you caught in your little Pokeballs. But on my side, I have a Pokemon as close to me as my sister, as one of my blood. If you can defeat Glaceon and me, I will entrust you with Clevior's fate. Will you battle us? Yes, I will. And allow Glaceon's true strength to chill you to your depths. Ah, I love Iridia's stand here. She's so bold, and she brings out a Glaceon. Too bad for her we have Ace up first, and too bad for her fire is good against Ice, though she might strike first. Yep. Oh, she's higher level too. Why does this happen every time I- Okay, thank god Ace just mastered Ember. Because otherwise this could get hairy real bad. I didn't notice it does a thing. Okay, I don't know if Strong Scout will kill this or not, but... Ace, listen, if there's ever a time you need to, like, survive an attack, this is now. Because you evolve if you win this. Ace. Mate. Come on. Are you kidding me? Dude, Ace. No. Ace dies to everything! Am I just bad at the game, or is Cynical just that shitty? Because that's twice now Ace has died. I don't want to use a revive because I know she'll heal us, but I want Ace to evolve from this. So, like, fuck it. I guess, you know, Nyla, if you go down, I kind of feel bad, but like, why can Nyla take hits, but Ace can't? Like, what the fuck? I feel so bad. Ace just always dies. It's... Wait, you don't evolve yet? Nani? Wait, what? Oh, it was level 14. Wait, did I leave Ace? Oh, I'm an idiot if it's level 14. I see. Pokeballs are simply your tools of choice, not products of discard for the Pokemon. You still understand the Pokemon that you've caught and treat them as partners. I feel better putting my trust in you now, I think. Let me see to your Pokemon's wounds. Ah, I'm an idiot. Now explain the Galaxy Team's plan. What do you mean to do with these foods? You see, put them to yeet them at your um, ace with, um, like, Pokeballs. So because you have to keep your distance, you'll match Clevier's favorite foods together, ball them up, and try to quell his frenzy by throwing them at him? You see, here's the thing. It'll either work, because it gets to eat the foods from a farm we get to keep safe, or we'll piss it off because we're throwing shit at him. One of the two. Interesting. So you develop soothing bombs of sorts to calm your lord. Very well. If it'll help soothe Clevier's frenzy, let's make these bombs with our very hearts and soul. You seriously, I'm struggling to stay up right now. Like, I'm actually sick. I don't know why I'm recording this. <sighs> there, a variably mounted of bombs. This should please Clevior if anything can. Now then, you ready yourself, and I will summon our mighty Clevior, Lord of the Woods. Let's not be hasty. Give me one second. I need to see if Ace can actually evolve. Are you serious? After everything you're ready for this moment, you're simply going to back out? Outrageous! I, I wish, like, Iradia kind of came to our defense there. Seriously, Ace didn't evolve, so I you wasted a revive for nothing, but Nyla, you know, fuck it, sure, Nyla evolved, go ahead. So, Nyla might honestly be the MVP again, because I know what we're about to fight is weak to Ice Fang, and Fire Fang, or at least half weak to Fire Fang, so it might be neutral to Fire Fang. But I know Ice Fang is super effective, so honestly, Nyla might just hard carry us this Let's Play. You know, fuck it, Nyla's the real starter, because Ace just keeps dying to everything. Okay, anyways, that aside, let's save the game in case my camera glitches again, because it's been doing that now for some reason. I just think my camera just doesn't like this Let's Play. Anyways, let's continue. Come on, you're the one with the best chance of using these bombs to the fullest. Oh, I have to talk to Iridia. Come on, I I'm talking to you. Lady. Bo boy. There we go. Now then, ready yourself. I will summon Clivio. Yes, ready. Here we go, let's do this. As I am. Or as I am. As am I. Eh. Oh, mighty Clevior, Lord of the Woods, though it is yet, though it isn't yet time of the ceremony, we prepared an offering of your favorite things. Levelant Lord, who works his might between the heavens and earth, we offer our gratitude and beseech you, reveal yourself to our eyes. Listen well, Ezel. Keep your focus on Clevior. Dodging will be vital. Try to avoid his moves as, throwing, as you're throwing the bombs. Right. Grasha! Yeah, we are gonna wanna like dodge like this is gonna have to involve dodging and Pokeball throwing. Here it comes. Damn, he mad. Okay, that looks cool at night, I'm not gonna lie. We 
Lords of the Woods, Clevior! Okay, I like how he's glowing though. Lightning didn't just work. Okay, here we go. Time to start our bubbles. Okay, to claim victory against an old Pokemon of Quote's Frenzy, you'll have to throw bombs at it until its Frenzy gauge reaches zero. If you manage to create an opening in the Noble's defenses, you'll be able to send out your Pokemon to battle against it. With a Pokemon battle, and the Noble's Guard will stay down for a brief time. During that window, bombs can be thrown more effectively than usual, so throw as many as you can. So we have an infinite number of them, so that's great. Yeet! 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 Fuck! Okay, he's gonna swing, he's gonna swing, he's gonna swing. Whoa! Aha! Bitch! Whoa! Oh, we got him, we got him, we got him! Go! Cyndaquil! Okay. I think Cyndaquil might die to this. I might have thrown Cyndaquil to die. Okay, here's a change, so Cleaver your power. It's gonna swing first. Oh, no! Cyndaquil! I forgot Stealth Rogue was an aggro move in this game! I think it is just me now. I think it is- well, how much health does it have? Oh wait, can we do the- okay, there we go, we can change the camera angle. I, I think it's just me that let- because I let that happen is the thing, too. Oh, we froze it, that's great. Fuck, you can still swing. Yeah, now it can take- why does Cynical die to everything? Oh, Frostbite just chops its health off instead of- okay, fair. That should be death. Or you survive. And Nyla will die. Huh. Well, there goes the plant to sweep you. Should die to that. Okay. Here we go. Throwing bombs. Boom, 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 ba -ba, boom, boom. So I guess that's its frenzy gauge. Oh, God. He's going back up around here. He's going back up. Okay. Ah! Oh, that was close. Okay. Come on. Oh, he's doing it again. He's doing it again. He's doing it again. Whoa! Aha! My ass hard missed, too. Whoa! Okay, dude. You need to back the fuck up. Seriously, though. Come on! Come on! Okay, you're getting way too close for comfort. Dude, I suck at aiming for real, though. Whoa! Okay, I don't know where you went. Okay, you're that close to me. Oh, I don't like what you're doing. I don't like your roar. I do not like that roar. Where'd you go? If I come across you on this side. Oh shit, you do turn around. Whoa! Okay! Whoa, okay, 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 what did you do, what did you do, what did you do? Okay, uh, I thought you sent, like, rocks my way. That's what you normally do when you're like that. Okay, so you didn't send rocks my way, but I'm just in front of the thing. Oh, it's a good th oh, so that's how you stop- Oh, okay, that's definitely gonna hurt. Okay. Boom, 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 Why are you flying? Oh god, you're going for round two again. Ah! Okay, so I guess I can focus a little bit more on this one. Oh god, he's coming back! Oh, that hurt. That actually hurt, though. For real. I did not know you could just tornado shot me like that. For real. Okay, wait, wait, wait. He's going back. Whoa! Aha! Okay, okay, okay. Run away, run away. I forgot to sprint! I forgot to sprint! I forgot to sprint! Whoa! Okay, that's hurt. That actually hurt, though. That actually hurt, though. Okay, okay. He's got a... Yeet! Okay, he's coming back. He's coming back. He's coming back. Whoa! Okay. I wish these had better range. Oh! Okay! Whoa! Whoa! Okay, that was close. 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 Whoa! Okay, okay. We almost got him. We almost got him. We almost got him. We almost got him. We got him. We got him. Just gotta wait for the gauge! Okay. Toss, 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 toss. We're dead on! Are you kidding me? We missed! On the moment we don't need to miss, right? Oh, he, he hit it. He hit it. He hit it. Thing. He hit it. Thing. He hit it. Thing. Yeah! Okay, we didn't have to battle him again, which is sad because I wanted to win. But okay, we win. Jesus. Yeet! And I wish the music wasn't so quiet. That's what Cluvia really looks like when he's not covered in gold. And now Ace is no longer the highest level. Because Ace just had to fucking go down in one hit. You owe me, Clevior. So Perceive the insect plate. So I'm assuming, yep, it increases it for bug type moves. Hi, you seem happy now. Okay, well, there he goes. So yeah, Scyther evolves into that, and I, um, kind of want one. What what happened? Some kind of light erupted from Clevior's body. Has Lord Clevior's frenzy mind truly been put at ease now? Does that confirm that that strange lightning was to blame for Clevior's unnatural power? Maybe. Well, this is what I think, after all we've seen. We know Strange Lightning came from out of the space timer the other night. Those bullets must have struck Clevior and driven him into a frenzy, after all. 
the lightning came from the space-time rift? But if Almighty Shino really does dwell beyond the space-time rift, then the strange lightning, it indeed was Almighty Shino's power. Then we were even right to try to interfere. Then were we even right to try to interfere? I happily went along with this plan to create some bombs, as if I knew what I was doing, like some kind of thoughtless fool. Outrageous! Calm yourself, Leanne. Remember that the Lord of the Woods has long been a protector, keeping the Pearl Clan safe from danger for Pokemon that might harm us. Would power sent by the true Almighty Shino have driven Clevior to turn on us and attack people and Pokemon indiscriminately? I doubt it. Well, Ezo accomplished just now, and indeed it needed to be done. Yeah, asshole. Could at least earn a little bit of gratitude. I mean, I'm the one that fucking saved your ass. You could have been a little bit nicer. I'm glad we could settle this without further strife from the Diamond Clan or the Galaxy Team. If you come across other Pokemon in the grip of this painful frenzy, please help them. Hmm, yes, fine. I suppose I must have concurred. I apologize for becoming briefly incomposed. I am grateful for what you've done for my lord. Please take these. On behalf of the Pearl Clan, consider it my apology for having spoken rudely to you earlier, and a token of my thanks. Is it an Eevee? It better be an Eevee, because I want an Eevee. Okay, well... Hmm. Let me care for your Pokemon as well, in appreciation for fighting on our behalf. If you can give us a rare candy, too, that'd be nice, because Cynical just died randomly. I think I finally come to believe that you are truly did fall out of the sky, though I still cannot imagine the reasons at play. And it seems we've settled things here, though between you and me, I wouldn't mind seeing Lord Cleaver in such a frenzy again. He was fearfully strong, after all. True. So, oh, well, we have too many, so I guess that kind of shows what happens with that. So, yeah, if you get too many items, you, um, get locked out of it, and it will go into your thing. Um, sadly, Lord Cleaver is nowhere to be found. However, we can find Scythers, and like I said, I do want one. I'm not going to say I'm going to use it on my final team or not, because that's undecided yet. But what is decided, oh, of course, it's the fucking... The, Okay, then. Never mind. I was just going to casually walk away, and it turned in my direction, so I kind of just feared for my life. Okay, I just need to catch one. Where's the big one at? Oh, shit, he saw me. For real. Okay, just gotta catch the Pokeball. Okay, I don't know how heavy Scyther is. I assume it's light. Just gotta get it from that angle. Come on, catch, catch. Yay! Okay, we got Scyther. I'm happy. Okay, then. Well, oh, Badoof can evolve now. Um, you know what? Screw it. Let's just evolve more team members, I guess, because fuck it. Uh, I don't know why Ace... I don't know if we can just click X to evolve it. I don't know why Ace still hasn't been able to evolve yet. Is it, like, level 18, or does Ace have to know something specific? Because I'm kind of disappointed that Ace didn't evolve. I really wanted him to evolve by now. I thought he would. Here's Babarel. We could have caught an Alpha one if we felt like it. Actually, I'm curious now, what new moves has everyone learned? Change moves. You have learned absolutely nothing new, so I'm questioning why you haven't evolved yet. What have you learned? You have learned absolutely nothing new. Great. Um, what if, apparently you knew Water Pulse somehow. What have you learned? Again, absolutely nothing new. Great, but you have Air Slash, so that's fun. Uh, I'm not removing your moves at all. Uh, yeah, I mean, Quick Attack's fine and all, but I, I'm good with my Fang moves, for sure. Um, you have all these powers. For some reason, you have Iron Defense, which I guess makes sense to some extent. And Weasel has learned absolutely nothing. Great. Okay. Well, let's take the long way back and actually trek there because even though, again, story, um, I do want to try to catch every Pokemon. Like, part of me wants to, part of me doesn't. It really just depends on how I'm feeling in the moment. Okay. Well, there goes that. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. Whoa, 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 wait. Let me get this first. Oh, fuck. I forgot I can't pick that up. Okay. Um, go. Star after. Ah! I have learned to dodge like a pro. Does Staraptor no intimidate? Apparently it doesn't. Okay, Air Slash. Let's see if Air Slash kills it. Okay, apparently Air Slash can kill it. I wanted to catch it. In hindsight, maybe I shouldn't have thrown Staraptor out. Okay, there we go. It's level 17. Oh, so that means you evolve at level 35. Got it. Okay, because I was wondering. So I guess we finally get to evolve Ace a little bit too late. If he had survived the Clivior fight, he probably would have leveled up. But, um, you know, it's fine. All, uh, all is well that ends well. Here's Quilava. Hopefully, Quilava can actually fucking take a few hits, unlike Ace, because Ace only took two before actually, actually, Ace would only take one before actually going down, so, yeah, there we go. Ace is now um, part of our team, fully. Okay, Ace, show us what you got. Hi, little buddy. How you doing? You seem so happy. Okay, anyways, back to the mission at hand, uh, and that's why I did that, solely just to evolve Ace, and totally not any other reason. 
But again, I do want to try out the whole um, getting that Pokemon at night thing, because I do believe it is at night that we can get them. So I'll try one more time. If I can't get them, I'll probably leave it to Google to figure that out for me, but we'll figure it out. So Goku Lava, hell yeah, taking out the things. We have a fuck ton of items now, honestly. Um, oh, Paris. I do want a Paris. I do want a Paris, though. That's cool. Okay, let's take the shot. Fuck. Well, I meant to try to catch it. I don't know if we can catch it now. Um, can we hide in the grass, maybe? You won't see us? Whoa! You trying to hit me, boy? Does it still see us? I don't think it does. Fuck! I thought that was a Pokeball! No, wait! <laughs> I thought that was a poke. I thought that was an ace. Well, ace, don't kill it, please. I beg of you. Okay, you put it in like the perfect health thing. Oh, come on. You gotta poison ace. You gotta do that to ace, really? He just evolved and you're doing this to my boy already. Um, well, might as well try to catch you. I don't really want to catch you now because you're an asshole, but let's try it. Come on, catch. Oh, that's not gonna catch, is it? Okay, prove me wrong then. Great. Well, Ace is on our team now. Wait. Wait, what? Ace is in another battle? Ace! Oh, this was that game you can do that. I forgot in this game you the battles will carry on if there's more Pokemon. I didn't remember that. Fuck. I wish I did. Okay, well, let's take the quick way up with Wyadir. I don't think Wyadir can get up that height, though. I, yeah, Wyadir can't. It's just too high, sadly. This might not be, though. Uh, a little bit. How about this? A little too high? Oh, just a little bit. Oh, there we go. Aha! Never doubt the wide ears. Um, well, in that case, the trek home begins. Again, I say, just because I do want to try to catch that Pokemon, though, it would be quicker just to go there the other way, because, you know, it is by the camp, so I probably should just, but, eh, wide ears fast enough, and we might run into some more Pokemon we haven't caught yet, which is kind of my fault, so, yeah. Damn, that camp is far away. Oh, I went past the deer hides, didn't I? I feel like I did. Yep, because there's the deer hides right there. Okay, wait, wait, let's quickly try it out. Let's quickly try it out. I did not know Alpha Geo did spawns here. Ow, dick. Okay. Let's quickly set the game to night time one more time. And if it doesn't show up, then I just give up entirely. I assume it will show up. I assume it will show up. Because I remember it was night time when I did this. So let's try one more time. If it's not here, I'll just pretend like I never did this. Okay, Pokemon are all... Oh yeah, I forgot that heals you too, so that's like a fun thing I can do if I never need it. Yep, the Alpha Geo dude's still there, so that's fun. Okay, why idea? Listen, I need you to somehow call to this Chimchar that I'm trying to... Okay, I didn't know I can get gold back this early. Oh wait, was that Chimchar? Was that Chimchar? Chimchar? Jimmy? Nope, that is not Chimchar. Um... Fuck... I know he was here last time. It was this exact route, this exact spot, and his ass was here. So where the fuck is he? Chimmy! I wanted Chimmy so badly. Even if I wasn't going to use him on my squad, because we already have a fire type, I was at least going to like like using him, but fuck me, I guess. Um, I forgot the Alpha Stagler was up here, actually. Well, oh, yeah, I forgot we can take fall damage. Okay, well, he's not here. And I don't really feel like exploring the rest of this, trying to find a Chimchar that may or may not be here. So, wait, okay. No! Whoa, 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 Matt, okay. Let's go to the field science camp. It, it's easier. Okay. <clears throat> okay, dude. Tell me what you got. Caught four Pokemon. Yeah, we would have caught five if Chimchar actually showed the fuck up. Well, at least we have new team members now, possibly. Did we go up in rank? I doubt we did, but let's hope we did, at least. Um, okay, we almost did. That's fun. Time to head back to the village and report to Commander Kamala about how we quelled the rage of, what's his name, um, Cleveor. We did our job good. That's what we can say. We did our job good. Oh, Bull is waiting for us. Hi, dude. I saw the light fading to the sky. You must have quelled the Lord Pokemon. And what do you have there? Could it be... And, ah, oh, those are the two fabled plates of old. Please let me have a look. Okay, what? I see. There's some letters carved into them. Let's see. This one said, oh, the one's from Wyadir and the one from the Clevior. Where all creation was born, that this being's place of origin. It seemed to be a phrase from a very old myth. 
how did you come across these? Well, one Pokemon gave it to me, and the other Pokemon gave it to me. They're just of two different types. I see. So you're given the place from, from when you impressed Wyadir and Clevior. That is quite something indeed. My heart is practically racing with excitement. It is my guess that you will find more plates like these scattered across Hisui. If we were to gather them all and, all and decipher the scripts on them, we may uncover something absolutely amazing. The, my the mysteries of the past. Oh, how they tickle my curiosity. What a joy to be alive in such times. Well, I must be on my way. Until next time. And there goes Cleverus Bolo. I would get our new team members out, but right now we are running a little bit low on time. So let's just quickly speed our way up to this. Um, you still have a Whirlpool, good sir. I thought you would have a um, Kaskuna by now. Or whatever the other one is. The one that evolves into Beetlefly, which we tried to catch. Anyways, here we go. All the way up. We'll eventually do the quest, by the way, for those of you wondering. I'm just waiting for, like, an episode to occur that I feel like doing it. But for now, on to Commander Kamado. <coughs> hmm. Well done! I have already received the reports of your exploits. You've successfully quelled Kaldor's fury, restoring peace of mind to Hisui's people. You are a stranger to us, one who fell out of the very sky, yet you have served the galaxy team admirably. I admit you have earned yourself some degree of recognition. But things are not settled yet. I've received word that there are other Pokemon nobles failing prey to falling prey to such frenzies everywhere elsewhere in Hisui. So carry on with your research and survey duties. Improve to you that are truly a useful asset to us. That is all. You are dismissed. You fellow Survey Corps members are likely to have to go at Wallflower. Go and join them. Cool. We have been dismissed to go eat food. Great. Thing is, I don't know if you would have auto given us our next quest if we were actually like the next stage level, because I know we have to be the next stage level to be the next quest. Benny, old chum, the usual order. Three servings of potato mochi, please. Oh, and if there's anything else that you'd recommend, by all means, bring it out. The whole village is gossiping up a storm about our young friend here, you know. He's got quite some luck to have come back on hard after facing off against that club York. Well, Ace got away with a very few scratches, but still. I dare say Ezel was well prepared, and he has a quick study of how Club York moved in battle, from what I heard. I straight up yeeted a bomb at him, and then dodged the second a stone almost hit me. I definitely, like, instinctively battled him. All in all, it was a very good show. A victory well earned. You didn't fucking see it at all. I, the only people that saw it was Irina and whoever the other kid was. We can feel safer about going about Survey Corp duties now, thanks to your efforts. Oh, by the way, why not try crafting some of these? I made the recipe based on directions Bert Benny gave me. Oh, we can craft smoke bombs now. Uh, one caster fern leaf and one suit roof leaf. Lovely. And now with that, we don't need to worry about being mauled by Cleavor either. Let's take our chance to study all the Pokemon that called the Obsidian Fieldlands their home. Actually, maybe now I might be able to catch that Pokemon Chimchar that I wanted to catch. Ezel. God, that wasn't fucking creepy at all. I've been waiting for you, Ezel. My name is Vessa. There's something real important I need you to tell you. Would you come with me? I don't want to now. You you have the most ominous soundtrack behind you, and you just said, My name's Vessa. That's obvious, Dean. Your name starts with a V. My last name starts with a V, and in my opinion, I'm creepy, so, like, that's sick. Uh, um, this is kind of a secret, but something terrible has happened. Isui's in a whole lot of danger. Hundreds of years ago, a being that brought calamity to this region was sealed away by someone using the power of a strange magic. But now, for some unknown reason, the magic has come undone and the seal is broken. I hate to think what might happen at this rate. What is it? So please, Ezel, hear me out. I need you to restore the broken seal. Sure. Just tell me what to do. At this point, we've seen all crazy type of shit. I mean, we ourselves are an anomaly, so we kind of have to believe this. Oh, thank you. I'm so happy you believe me. I just knew you'd be willing to help. This odd keystone is for you. Keep it safe. Odd Keystone, you say? That rings a bell from Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, and that looks very familiar. A mysterious stone that can be used to collect wisps and glow into eerie purple light. After the seal was broken, a whole bunch of wisps scattered across a Hisui. Hundred and seven of them in total. A hundred and seven of them in total. With the Odd Keystone I give you, you'll be able to gather them up. Why specifically a hundred and seven? Why not just a flat out hundred? See, the wisps are normally invisible, but not to the holder of the Odd Keystone. I see. But why are you trusting me with this task? I know it's a huge task, but please, you just have to gather all the wisps for me. There's one real close to where we are now. How about you start with that one? See that flame hovering over there? Try touching it. Okay. I can't really go into Wyadir right now, so I don't really have much choice. And okay. It... I like how we did that face. Kind of like, okay, well, fuck it. Okay, you, whoa. The wisp has just been absorbed into the keys, odd keystone, just as it should be. 
I'm sorry, but Noni, how did you move that quickly? Thank goodness I picked you to help me with this. Come talk to me if you ever need help finding the remaining wisp. And one last thing, as you gather more and more wisp, I'll give you as a reward as thanks. I'll wait here for a while and you can carry out your search. Good luck! I see. You worry me, child. Not gonna lie. A little bit. Next day. Don't be another mission immediately. Whoa! The Galaxy Team hairdresser really is, dare I say, cutting edge. Oh, that was not a male. Oh, hey, you're Ezel, the boy who quote Clevior, aren't you? You look like you're from the Diamond Clan. That's me. Am I right? I knew it. You've got the correct reputation, you know. I mean, you quote one of the Almighty Shino's chosen ones. Some people are actually kind of scared of you for doing that something in a boat. To be fair, it had fucking axes for hands, and I stood up to it like a bitch, so yeah. I'm a Zooter, by the way. I'm a Warden of the Diamond Clan. I fucking knew it. My special skill is giving haircuts. Real nice to meet you. Oh, snip. But I came here to talk to your Mr. Kamado. See you around. Well, it seems like we'll be handling that in the next episode, when we care. So, I'll see you all then. Off screen, I'm gonna go try to get my boy, um, Wukong, even if we're never gonna use him. It's at least worth trying to get him. So, without further ado, oh, uh, oh, well, apparently she wants a Hippomatas from the Crimson Mirelands. Well, sure, I didn't mean to start a quest with you. I was just trying to do that. But yeah, buy clothing. Anyways, I'm gonna end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed. In the next one, we will figure out what, I already forgot her name, what she wants and why she wants it. So, I'll see you all then. Don't forget to like, subscribe, don't forget to follow Twitch, and don't forget to check us out.